Right, room six, our, our time's up. Our visitor will be arriving very shortly. And you might be? Uh, Brody. Oh, Brody. Um, thank you for meeting me. I'm, I'm very, very excited to be working with your business here. Um, where to next, Brody? Uh, oh, the staff are waiting for us, are they? So you involve all your staff in the company decisions, is that correct? Most of the time. Most of the time. Okay, when do you not involve the staff in the company decisions? Um, Okay, the big decision. This could be a big decision, so I'll, I'll leave that to you. Are you the CEO, Brady? No, I'm just receptionist. Oh, you're just the receptionist. Okay, thank you very much. So, the CEO is, the CEO is waiting. Oh, I'm just going to... That beeping is just my um, secret device because I've got the Schneider on. <laughs> Obviously, you'll probably sign an agreement, is that correct? Okay. Um, are you familiar with this logo? Did anybody tell you if they're familiar with that logo? Okay. I'll just read it to you. United Nations Environment Code. Dear, I'm writing on behalf of Akfin Steiner, the Director of the United Nations Environment Program. As you know, there are a group of countries who endeavour to promote and protect the Earth's environment. Some of our governments are cover such issues as atmosphere, marine and terrestrial ecosystems, environmental governance and green economy. I'm writing to you because we've heard about the work your company did following the Christchurch earthquake in regard to green and safe houses and buildings. United Nations Environment Program helped your company to design and create a prototype of a small, sustainable village capable of living beneath the Earth's surface. We have another company called Stratosphere Solutions who have already completed a similar project for above the Earth. I look forward to meeting with you in a breakfast early next week. I'll email you once I hear that you're able to take on this project. Yours sincerely, Anderson. On behalf, personal assistance. 